Uh, I want to wish a great welcome to everyone uh, for our monthly healing meditation. And today in particular, uh, we especially need it. (laughs) Sue and I both have COVID, and we're in just the last days of quarantine here. But today, I really wanted to do, I was going to do this meditation earlier in the week, and I said, no, let's just do this one for everyone, because it's a similar meditation that I do. I did it last week during uh, Qigong, and so if you see me on Facebook, you'll see I'm wearing my white gi. And because my intuition on what's happening in the world right now is related specifically as well to the new openings and the new beginnings of what is some would call it a fiscal new year, but it is in fact a time of new beginnings of all things. As we began with the solstice uh, 10 days ago with the days getting longer, we saw the worst, darkest night, the longest night of the year. And now with that hope and light flowing through, we have the additional opportunity to create and to be the new. And one of the reasons in particular I wanted to wear my gi today was because in Qigong we talk about awareness, not just mindfulness. And I wanted everybody to take a moment today and notice what that difference is between mindfulness and awareness. Awareness being that aspect of are you aware of where you are right now? Are you totally and completely present right here, right now? Are you aware of your awareness? And as simplistic as that sounds, your ultimate awareness, that infinite aspect of your being, is not related, in fact, to your mind. It is not related to your thoughts or your feelings or your body in any way, shape, or form. You are aware of your thoughts and your mind, and your body experiencing those feelings. Your awareness, to me, is that infinite aspect of who and what you truly are. And these new beginnings with this new year are an opportunity for you to be and embody that what I would normally have called the I am presence. It is your infinite self. It is you as the knowingness of all that is. And from that space, I invite you to pause for a moment. And we're going to look back at a few things that happened that were great for you over the past year or the past few years. And so I ask you to take a moment and just settle and relax. And inhale deeply from the center of the earth and the center of the universe, bringing a combined breath into the higher heart. A few long, slow, deep, powerful breaths. I want you to remember now a moment in the past that you were grateful for something that has happened. And I want you to feel that feeling and turn up the dial of feeling that gratitude up to its highest level. And now I want you to think back to a second moment of you appreciating a situation for what it was and for the gifts that it brought you. 
and I want you to ramp up that feeling of appreciation. Allow that swell of emotion to fill your heart and your higher heart. Now I want you to imagine the third moment in the past. Where your pride and joy filled your heart with an amazing emotion of pride and joy. Allow your heart to feel that joy and that pride. And now bring your awareness back to your heart. On this time, I'd like you to imagine something you would like to see happen in your future. And to begin, I ask you to be present and to notice the space around your perineum. Notice the space around your perineum in space. And on your next in-breath, without thinking hard, I want you to lift the, slightly lift the anus and lift the vagina if you have one and bring that energy and the energy of this future potentiality up through the back of the spine, up through the back of the neck, through the back of the cerebellum and into the center of your pineal, right into the center of your brain. And I want you to feel and hold that amazing joy and happiness you would have if you, that future potentiality came to fruition. Allow your brain to wire and rewire your body to create a future memory of that future potentiality. And relax, totally and completely relax. Totally at ease, totally safe, totally protected. Return your awareness back to the space around your perineum. Notice your perineum in space. Notice the space around your perineum in space. And on your next inhale, I'd like you to take that same future potentiality and amplify that joy and happiness you would receive. And on your next inhale, I want you to lightly lift up the anus and lift up the vagina and bring up that energy pulsing it up through the back of the the back of the body, the back of the spine, the back of the neck, the back of the brain, and into the center of the brain, allowing your pineal to send out that joy and happiness 
in an explosion of joy. Amplify that feeling of joy if you receive that future potentiality. Allowing your mind to wire and rewire the brain and the body to feel that future potentiality as a memory from the future. And relax. Totally and completely relax. I invite you now to be aware of your perineum in space and the space around your perineum in space. And yet again, I invite you to take that future potentiality from that field of infinite potentialities. Choose the same one. And on your next in-breath, I want you to accelerate to the maximum that feeling of joy and hope that you would have if you had that future potentiality. On your next inhale, I want you to lightly lift up the anus, lift up the vagina, just lightly, and pulse that energy all the way up through the back of the spine, the back of the neck, through the cerebellum, and into the center of your brain. And I want you to hold that joy I want you to allow that love to flow through wiring and rewiring your entire brain to creating a future memory of that future potentiality. And relax. Totally and completely relax. I invite you now to be aware of the space around your solar plexus in space. I want you to imagine now a second future potentiality from the field of infinite future potentialities. And on your next in-breath, I want you to lightly pulse around the solar plexus and pulse that energy and love and power up through the back of the spine, the back of the neck, through the cerebellum and into the center of your brain, right in the pineal allowing that pineal to hold that joy and love and happiness from that second future potentiality. Allowing the power of peace and love to pulse through your brain, pulsing through your body, wiring, rewiring it, to accept and acknowledge that future potentiality and the memory of that future potentiality. And relax. Totally, completely relax.
I invite you again to be aware of the space around your solar plexus in space. And using that same second intention, on your next inhale, I invite you to lightly pulse the space around your solar plexus, pulsing that amazing power of peace and love up through the back of the spine, through the back of the neck, the cerebellum, and into the center of your pineal, allowing the power and the pulse of peace and happiness and joy (coughs) to pulse through your brain, wiring and rewiring your brain. as it creates a memory of this future potentiality. Notice again the space around your solar plexus in space. Remembering yet again that second future potentiality, I want you to greatly amplify to the max that feeling of peace and power and joy and happiness you would feel if that you could Feel that future potentiality right here, right now. And on your next in-breath, I want you to lightly pulse the peace and the space around your solar plexus in space. Pulse that energy up through the back of the spine, the back of the neck, through the cerebellum and into the pineal. Allowing the pineal to explode in peace and harmony and joy and love creating a memory of that future potentiality, wiring and rewiring your brain to remember it. I'm relaxed, totally and completely relaxed, totally safe, totally protected. I invite you now to pick a third future potentiality from the field of infinite future potentialities. And I want you to know there's a space around your heart and higher heart. I want you to notice a space around your heart and higher heart in space. On your next in-breath, I want you to be aware of that third future potentiality in the space around your higher heart in space. And on your next in-breath, I want you to lightly pulse your heart and higher heart and pulse that energy and vibration of the truest form of love up through the back of the spine, up the back of the neck, through the cerebellum and into the pineal, allowing that 
amazing feeling of love and joy and happiness you would feel if you had that future potentiality right here, right now, living it as if it was now. And relax. Totally and completely relax. I want you to imagine that third future potentiality yet again in the space around your higher heart and your heart in space. On your next in breath, I want you to lightly pulse the love and joy and happiness in your heart and high heart and pulse that beautiful energy up through the back of the spine, the back of the neck, through the cerebellum and into the pineal, allowing the love to explode in the fireworks of joy and happiness if that future potentiality was to come true. If you were to feel that right here, right now wiring and rewiring your brain for that future potentiality, allowing it to remember the joy and happiness you would feel if you had that. And relax. Totally and completely relax. Notice the space around your heart and high heart in space yet again. On your next in-breath, I want you to lightly pulse that same third future potentiality, pulsing the love and joy up through the back of the spine, the back of the neck, through the cerebellum, into the center of your brain, into the pineal, allowing it to pulse through from the pineal and leaning out through every cell of your being wiring and rewiring your brain to feel, to know the joy and the love and the happiness. Allowing that spark of infinite peace and happiness to spark through your brain. And relax. Totally and completely relax.
Returning back 100% back to right here, right now. Bringing your awareness back to right here, right now. And so it is. When you're ready, return uh, return back and let me know if you're if you're back. 